the two years of Columbia Business School made me a lot, and I owe a lot to the Columbia Business School. Soko Lee, business class of 1988. I could have a chance to meet a lot of uh, Columbia alumni working in the Wall Street and what they're talking and what their real experience, that made me exposed in real finance world. First thing I'm surprised is that 40% students women. You know, at the time in Korea, kind of male-dominant society, learning and living in the United States, very uh, fruitful and healthy. So I travel a lot. I have uh, friends in many schools, so Japan, Korea, <laughs> so Chicago, LA. I'm the president of the uh, Columbia Business School Alumni Association, and uh, I'm the vice president of the total uh, Columbia Alumni Association in Korea. When Glenn Hubbard, now the dean of the business school, inaug was inaugurated as a dean, he first made a business trip to Asia. Take stock of my bond, sir. It was the first time the business school dean visited to Seoul at the time. We had a big ceremony in Centennial uh, ceremony. It means that the business school has a hundred birthday party. We did, and I organized a lot of uh, things, and I invited a lot of uh, alumni. 40 to 50 uh, Columbia Business School students and one professor visit the Korea for a week. And they visit Korean conglomerate or Korean blue chip. Today is my double blessing is that I got a medal and my son graduated commencement day of Columbia College. The United Nations treasures its partnership with Columbia University. And we are allies across the world. The Korean's most respected man is the Pan Ki-moon, Secretary General of UN. I met him. So maybe triple blessing for me. <laughs>